Once there lived in a forest. An elephant who was full of pride about his strength and abilities. He was so proud that he did not even respect the king of the forest, the lion. When other animals attended the meetings, this elephant refused to go there and gave excuses for his absence. He kept boasting about himself and said that he had all the qualities to become a king. Thus, he spent his time in daydreaming. One fine day, a clever jackal came into this forest in search of food. He saw the elephant happily basking in the river. Since the elephant was all alone, the jackal felt that he could be an easy target for him. He also felt that if only he could kill the elephant, he would be able to have sumptuous meals for the next few days. The jackal got tempted by this idea and started planning to somehow trick the elephant. He knew that the elephant was so much bigger than him that he could never match him in size. His only resort was to overcome the elephant through his cleverness. Suddenly he remembered that there was a bog in his forest. He thought carefully. Hmm. I must convince the elephant to come with me to the bog, and then he shall be trapped. Thus, he stepped towards the elephant, cleared his throat, and said, O oh, great king, my humble respects to you. The elephant was surprised by this sudden voice. He looked around and saw that the jackal was standing in front of him with a bowed head. The elephant got carried away by the way the jackal addressed him. He happily asked the jackal, Hey, who are you? Why are you addressing me as the king? I am not yet the king of the forest, but you may see me on the throne very soon. The jackal knew that his plan was working on the elephant. He explained, No, your highness. I did not mean that you are the king of this forest. But I meant that you shall be the king of our forest. The elephant was surprised to hear that and inquired further. Your forest? Where is it? The jackal continued. Sir, I belong to the next forest. There is no discipline there. And we are in a mess since we do not have any king. Therefore, all the residents of the forest have decided that one of us would go in search of the strongest creature in the nearby forests and make him our king. Accordingly, I came to this forest to find the perfect creature. Who could rule our forest? When I saw you, I at once realized that you are a responsible and noble being who would make an excellent king. 
and so I addressed you as king. Now, sir, would you mind coming with me to our forest and accept the crown? We are in an urgent need of a king. And the crowning ceremony needs to be held as soon as possible. Totally flattered by these words. The elephant happily got up from his place. And walked along with the jackal. Who then asked him to lead in the front. Since he was the king. The elephant dreamily moved in the front. He crossed his forest and reached the next one. He did not notice the bog, but kept walking with confidence. But as soon as he stepped into the bog, he got stuck. He tried to move his legs but to no avail. He called out to the jackal and said, Friend! I got stuck! Please help me get out! Go and call your friends! The jackal laughed loudly and said sarcastically, you have been fooled, my dear king. I did not bring you here to make you the king, but to make you our prey. Yes, I will bring my friends now, not to rescue you, but to feast on you. So saying, the jackal fled to bring his friends. While the elephant kept calling for help, until he finally died. <laughs>